Hi friends, this is Scalpoon Pisa and uh, it's amazing everything is the same here in this crazy chrysacosis infected country of ours wake up in the morning watch the news and there is another shooting crazy people in a rampage happened in Vegas this time these people <laughs> and why is this happening like I said at nauseum is thanks to Christ psychosis nobody seems to realize that religious beliefs are a mental illness a psychopathy and there is churches all over the place and places of worship all over the world every country has their nuts and they're all psychotic they're all believing gods and imaginary friends and all that stuff and uh, <laughs> It's the same thing happening over and over and over. Like I repeat ad nauseum in my videos. Christianity is a mental illness and a stupid, a stupid, sane, or in other words, mentally healthy, atheist organizations in the United States of America are worthless and blind. They don't see that the problem and the source of all this nonsense and craziness and psychopathy is churches. And universities that are infected with Christ psychosis, they believe in this zombie that is wrecked and say with blood. What an example for kids. The zombie Jesus, the blood saves, and it's good, and it's a virtue. So you have to torture, you have to torture people, you have to suffer, you have and, and you, you look at the crusades, the inquisitions, all because of religious psychosis. And Islam psychosis, all this, the same thing. Religion is a mental illness all have blood and psychopathy and this is what happened these people are brought up brought up in Christianity infected homes nobody is born with uh, with those beliefs none nobody is born a Christian a Muslim a psychotic or a conspiracy theory psychotic nobody everybody is born with a brain that is blank they don't speak English they don't speak uh, French they don't speak any, any language all the, the brain is blank when it's born and then it's infected and the brain is weak genetic defects bad mutations then the brain when it grows up is accepts even this pattern education accept bizarre metamagical beliefs as if they were reality and then they, they go into this anti-government, these conspiracy theories, these going to church when they were younger. Uh, they they give him about zombie Jesus and about the ghost, about spirits, and all that 12th century crap in this 21st century. That's what I say in my videos. And these people are imbeciles and these schools don't teach kids science. From the beginning, teach them science, teach them sex, teach them about Sex education, where are the organs for? Where are the tits? Where are the milk? Where is the sperm? Where, you know, all that. Teach to kids. Kids are not stupid. But oh no, that's forbidden. And that is the cause of all the problems. These kids grow up. Grow up uh, in this atmosphere over a Christianity infected country. We have Jehovah's Witness pieces of shit idiots, you know, stuck in the 12th century knocking on people's doors. You have churches, you have uh, libraries with Bibles and crap like that. These uh, this Christian libraries, Christian bookstores. What kind of nonsense is that? And they get all this conspiracy theory going because the people are stupid and educated. These kids are, are grown up. And then the ones that are educated, they're morons. They have mega churches. They're thinking of themselves. They're selfish pieces of shit. And atheists are blind idiots. Educated atheists in the United States of America are blind, worthless idiots. American atheists, blind idiots. They are worthless. They are good just to make benches. That's what the atheists did. They created a bench just to protect the, the Ten Commandments. What a bunch of idiots. Go to the churches. Protest the people in churches. Uh, raping the minor. These people are making millions and millions of dollars. They don't pay taxes. And they keep infecting the people, uh, kids, with, uh, with all this garbage. Make a church. Now they have this, this, uh, this uh, rock and roll church. It's idiots. And, and why do people flock to churches? Because they are ignorant. Ignorant. Deluded. 
imbeciles. They are not taught science. They should watch cosmos. They should watch scientists should be teaching things. Get rid of all these idiots in Congress that are Christian imbeciles. Because the United States is a Christianity infected nation. And that's the problem. And this, this Christianity, this garbage beliefs, turned into conspiracy theorist beliefs, into the Yeti, into the white supremacists, into the Aryan Brotherhood, into all these imbeciles. And atheists, Dawkins, Harris, and the rest of idiots, and blind idiots, they don't say anything. They just go on protesting in creation in museums, talking like, like if these people were saying, no, the cause is churches infecting the brain of children. When they grow up, if they, if they don't have a strong brains, the, what happens is that they go and then shoot people, and they go into this conspiracy theory crap, and this is what you have in Vegas today, and you have it all the time. You have the Joker in theaters. You have this little kid, um, uh, kid uh, 26 children. I mean, it is, and nobody sees it. Nobody talks about Christianity. That is the cancer. That's the HIV of the brain nobody talks about. That's the problem. Incredible. Mentally healthy, aka atheist intellectuals, wake up. God believes a brain disease and is spreading. Church. And you know, there are 8,000 languages spoken in the planet. English was, and all these modern languages were not spoken 2,000 years ago. What the hell do you think? This is stupid imbeciles get the, the word Amin. Because in Arabic, you know, Amin, that comes from a man. That comes, you know where it comes from? From the god Atun and the god Amun. The sun god. Atun is the god that masturbated into his mouth, spitting the whole universe into existence. But they are so damn stupid they don't realize. I think English was spoken 2,000 years ago, and the earth was flat, and the United States was the only country around that's still there over 2,000 years. That's so stupid, the American idiot. You know why? Because they teach a stupid Bible crap, and they allow the churches to infect the brain, keeping the children's brains retarded, filtered. That is the problem, and nobody seems to see it. And they came with these stupid things like, a man. That's what a man means. It doesn't mean so does be it. No, like a stupid Christian imbecile say, no, a man, it comes from the, from the God, the sun God, Atun, Amun, which is basically the penis of the sun that fertilizes the earth, the rays of the sun God, which is the penis we have. God is cock in a way, and these idiots don't see it. They, all, they have a 12th century thinking in this 21st century. Amazing. Get rid of churches and place uh, pastors in mental institutions they belong. Behold, the God Atun, Amen, Amun, of many names, the God that masturbated into his mouth, creating the universe into existence. And here it is. When you go to church and you kneel down, you're praying to Atun. When you say Amen, you're sacking the semen which is also the breast milk, as depicted here and here. So, Christ psychotic infected imbeciles, the only creator is the penis of your dads. And then you have Bergdahl. <laughs> Amazing. This guy was educated, homeschooled, by this Bergdahl family, by these idiots. This is the parents of the soldier that was over there. And he, according to all his friends and buddies that were there, he left his post. He deserted. What do you think is that? You can volunteer and you think, oh, the army is good and we're going to defend the country. When you go over there and you see reality, you get scared. You don't want to be there. And then Afghanistan has all these drugs, the sacraments. You see him when he was uh, freed after five years? The head like this. What do you think that is? That is, these are psychedelic substances. That's what happens. And these idiots don't know it. And the people are so stupid in the United States government because they are brought up in a Christianity infected nation. They don't know their ass from a hole in the ground. They cannot tell the difference. They don't have any science education. They have just churches that the parents take them every Sunday. That's when you got the Christian uh, American Nazism, the KKK, the, uh, all in the stupid Bible. And they go over there like crusaders. And then they, reality hits them. Because they had never been in any other countries. They don't know they're ass from a hole in the ground. And they're imbeciles.
they are still targeted because the only thing the United States government gives them is ridiculous Christianity infected morality churches are stacked in the 12th century that's what could screw up their brains so guess what happened the guy didn't like it and he left he wanted to get out of there and these are stupid ridiculous parents Christ that causes infected parents look at what he's saying this moron this Robert Bergan his father is working to figure all oh, this God will repay for the and then he removed the post see what happened just like a stupid McCain it's another piece of shit imbecile and then they call him a hero the guy got shut down was prisoner for seven years in, in, in uh, North Vietnam that's McCain that's a stupid senator from rich parents Christian infected imbeciles and then he took uh, put Sarah Palin as a vice president what a bunch of crap and this guy says it's a senator this guy is a senator McCain is another piece of shit and Americans they're so stupid and ignorant they don't do research they don't study history and what do you get you get moronic idiots KKK and white supremacists and they go to church and they love guns and then they shoot people and get killed and then everybody wonders why because America has a very short memory because they go to church they give all the money to the church and the ones that benefit are the churches psychotic imbeciles this Christianity infected America for you and that is the problem that's the cause of all the problem churches and a stupid atheist blind idiots they don't see it and American churches send Christ psychosis infected missionaries to places that don't belong causing hate for America things that we do we have to be very sensitive to the fact that North Koreans are carefully monitoring the activities of Americans and we exactly. should be extremely cautious about exactly. any kind of religious literature exactly or even talk about religion exactly uh, more on Christians they go to North assholes Koreans see Christianity not just as a religious threat but as a, a threat directly from the US that Christians in North Korea are supporting the US against North Korea and want to bring down the regime of the regime and they see uh, religious proselytizing as a very real risk for something. Exactly. You go, no, they may not seem criminal to you. Exactly. Perfectly legal. Piece of shit Christians. In the United States, that creates a huge problem. Good. Chop their heads off. Engaged in religious activity when he was thrown into a North Korean gulag. Christ psychotic missionaries are the lowest of the law and they go to places they do not belong. Uh, this person did would certainly be seen as a serious offense. But more broadly, the current leader, Kim Jong un, has been a audience that he's a tough leader. Tougher than are strange. Its motives are completely inscrutable. In 2009, Kunsen entered into a paranormal Photoshop contest, the dark character appearing in the background. Took on a life of its own on the web. See? Followers writing their own See? twisted horror like stories. Like Jesus about Christ. A mythical creature on websites including creepypasta.wiki. You know, certain people are that way. You know, if it's something that's real or could be real. That's much more frightening. Kunsen, known as Vic, by the tragedy in Wisconsin. And my heart goes out to the families of those affected by this terrible fantasy from reality. There's absolutely no way to predict who's going to be more impacted than others, except to say that children are far more susceptible and far more vulnerable. And this ignorant woman doesn't realize that churches are infected the brain of children with this garbage. And see, the problem is, is it's the girls that kill another 12 year old for the fantasy of a slender man a fantasy why a 12 year old believe a fantasy is real and he does that reality versus fantasy now ask yourself what do the all the churches teach what do they do what does the bible teach doesn't the bible teach mythologies they're accepted as reality by adults. By adults. That is schizophrenia. When a person is unable, in this 21st century, when we know that the brain is the creator of thought, when fantasies are accepted as reality, and I call them iphophoebia, imaginary friends or foes irrational beliefs. When these iphophoebias are accepted as reality, that is indicative of a malfunctioning brain, a disconnect, a neural disconnect. And like I said, all religions have a phoebus, all of them. 
and all schizophrenias have iphobia, imaginary friends of four irrational beliefs, acceptance. Like, like Dr. Sapolsky, a neuroscientist said, metamagical thinking, bizarre metamagical beliefs in neurological disorders. And all religions are composed of bizarre metamagical belief, as is characters like a slender man. And all mythologies are composed of that. The Lord of the Rings, Alice in Wonderland, all the characters in distant land are, are Ifofiba, are uh, imaginary friends. Children accept everything in this land to be reality. I mean, I'm talking about very young children. I'm talking about five, six year olds. But if a 12 year old believes that everything in this land is reality, they have a problem with the brain. They are filtered, retarded because of God. But God is an eye for FIBA, imaginary friend or foe, irrational belief, acceptance. So all religions are neurological disorders. The, 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 they don't belong in this 21st century. And they spread where? In churches, in mosques, in synagogues. Religion is a mental illness, not unlike schizophrenia. It's one of the schizophrenias. And mentally healthy, in other words, atheist, because an atheist is a person without belief in Ifofiba, without believing God, which means that a person who doesn't believe in God is sane or healthy, which is atheist. And atheists are so clueless in the United States of America, they don't understand they don't understand that religions and schizophrenia are one and the same. It's the same neurological disorder without, uh, with a different name. And they don't understand that. That's what I find in my YouTube videos. I am with reality, empirical facts, tangible evidence, reality. And they're all created in the brain because we are nothing but product of, a, of coitus, a sperm and fertilizing the egg. That's the way we our brains came into existence, product of evolution. So atheists, scientists, intellectuals, wake up. The neurological disorder of God belief or Ifofiba is going to make us extinct. Climate warming, they are deniers of science, they are imbeciles, they are in control of the governing of the United States because the United States is a Christ psychosis infected nation. Like it or not, it is a fact. So atheists, Scientists and intellectuals, wake up. Complaining churches, put all the chrysocotic infected imbeciles in control of the United States of America, including the Supreme Court. Put all these filtered imbeciles, ignorant, deluded people that believe in imaginary friends, just like this 12-year-old believe in a slender man. Well, Christians believe in Sabi Jesus. It's another mythological character. Enjoy this truth. Some big I believe is a brain disease. This narrow gate to Jesus, some people are rolling right by it. Watch Lance followers pour in over the day's five services. You just leave like filled with the Holy Spirit and you don't feel judged at all when you walk in. Simple. Found God. Simple and plain, yes. His presence here. And America's getting their ignorance and psychosis in the millions of churches in America. Uh, they believe all that crap of the 12th century would be true. Moses is already crazy. Brian Houston founded Hillsong 30 years ago in Australia with his wife, Bobby. Are you concerned? I've never failed anybody. Let me give the creator a shot in my life. Let me give the... Is Carl the... Celebrity pastor becomes the draw. Um, it's a distraction from Jesus, and that should be the draw. See how stupid American ours. Uh, they don't realize that the only creator is the penis of our dad. And in ancient times, it was considered the Autobotos of Atun, which is sacred. The penis was sacred. And a sperm or milk was collected. It was sacred of the God. Here are the empirical facts. Learn this science. And Gravity truth. suddenly splits off from the super. As the universe expands, it cools, which somehow sets off a burst of energy fueling the hyperinflation of the universe locks in the uniformity of the universe pictured by the WMAP satellite. Less than a second old when the superforce decays into the separate forces of nature. 
after the Big Bang, the temperature of the universe has dropped to a mere one billion degrees. An act of coitus created us, and the Big Bang initiated the evolution of the universe, creating our brains, that's what we think with. And then, of course, when it's infected with cryopsychosis, it goes berserk and does this. And, uh, in fact, had been there through the whole thing. So, uh, you know, I think what happened uh, with that stand- I know the shooting. Biden, Bundy, the What's Richard, new? And armed federal agents uh, back in April. Uh, Militia. What do you think that comes from? Patriot movement for the Religious movement. psychosis. Well, I want to be really clear. Churches. Uh, Mark, I just want to be really clear kids, that making criminals out of it. down the movements of these uh, two shooters, specifically with regard to the Bundy Ranch and, and Mr. Bundy himself, Clive and Bundy himself, and he doesn't know if in fact they were there, and it is also not Bundy. 100% Christ that goes that they were there, just that, that a lot of the rhetoric seems to be uh, very similar, but we're continuing on. thought they were starting some kind of revolution. Eyewitnesses say they heard the shooters yell the word revolution as they shot and killed two police officers who were simply eating their lunch. And then the rampage continued towards a Walmart where a shopper was then killed. Thank you, Ashley. I'm, I'm honored to be on your show to talk about Alan. I'm grateful you're talking about Alan. He really is the key to this story. He and his partner and the poor victim that fell at Walmart are good in eulogy only, and Alan is the ab absolute opposite of that. Alan is easy to eulogize because that all, that's all he was, was good. And Alan is the... I think is pretty clear, Wolf, uh, is that the Bundy standoff... See? See uh, the moron? ...the BLM and federal law enforcement back down... Uh, Southern poverty. Weapons, He's a piece of uh, shit idiot. Seen as a massive idiot. victory by the Patriot movement. I Patriot. Think they're all, yeah, Patriot, Patriot are Christians. They're Nazis. Nazis, Nazis, Nazis are Christians. Tens of thousands Study of history, people, imbecile. Uh, saw what happened... That's what it is. Race. White supremacists, KKK, Christians. ...against the federal government. Christians' organization, they get the stupid thing in, in uh, churches. The war that they all uh, Incredible. wish for and wait for with the government. Uh, as very important, it might even have been what pushed them over the edge into actually starting really? to murder people. You've been studying eyes in this anti-government violence that we're now seeing? Christians, the churches! Yeah, I think there is. I'm not sure I could prove it. It is, it's blind. Since Obama blind. Uh, appeared on blind. the in the fall of 2008, we've seen blind. a very dramatic uptick in these kinds what of What an things. imbecile! You know, one of the more remarkable yes, things you were saying that have happened recently stupid he is. is that this has even spilled over into Canada. I was not up uploading the video that I'm making, and this is just happening now. Because, you know, I, I started this morning uploading the, the video, you know, making the video. And this idiot comes around. Like I said, I mean, these people are stupid and blind. He never mentions Christianity. He says, oh, they found a swastika on the guy, and... Uh, he was a uh, white supremacist, and, the, and he never mentions the main thing. It is Christianity. This imbecile, this, I mean, the guy is so stupid. It's incredible how blind he is. Why don't they put a, a, an atheist, a historian, a neurologist that actually tell these morons what, what the reason of all these problems? And he doesn't see it. He doesn't understand history. He doesn't understand that all Europe was... Christian, they love Hitler. Hitler was selected, he used the cross, which is a symbol of the sun, the, the swastika as a cross gamara, and then on top of that, he used also the regular cross. It's interlocking, he was a Christian. Christian, Christian uh, going to church. Hitler had a, a God with us in his, in his buckle. He created, uh, out of the gospel, he, uh, he created his Bible, which is Mein Kampf. And these imbeciles don't know it. The thing is something separate. No. You know, United States, a racist United States, Christian, psychotic imbeciles, they, they love Hitler in the 1930s. The, the uh, genomics, the, uh, the people that were uh, considered the blacks inferior and all that, and uh, you know, ep epigenetics and, and all these um, uh, controlling the race in the, in the 30s. They were concentrating the blacks and people that were, seemed feeble and all that. United States were doing all this in the 30s. And guess who, who asked them for help? You know, check it out. Hitler, Christian Hitler, asked American for help. California with the program, the eugenics pro program. He had, and, and the uh, United States helped Hitler. 
The United States, you want to start with the racist crap, anti, it's all Christian piece of shit, racist, anti-black, anti-Jews, and anti everything. Idiots. And this is why they don't understand it. That's why uh, uh, United States helped all the Nazis escape. The Vatican helped them escape. They're all Christians. They went to South America. They ignore it because the, the Americans hated the Jews also. These fucking imbeciles don't realize that. And they're all in churches, as I said. Incredible. Here are the facts and connected dots. Google this uh, special uh, thing. It was a, a video on uh, CNN uh, last year about this. Keep in mind always, dear friends, that we create thinking with the brain, but we are all related. We are all related. We evolved mutated primates, originated in Africa. We are all related. We are related by DNA to all life forms on this planet. Keep that in mind. Everything, everything that you see here comes from the planet. We transform it with our brains, with our in intellect. As long as we don't have a, you know, look at the internet. All the technology. And it's thanks to having a mentally healthy brain with science. In other words, an atheist brain that is the reason we have all the technology we have. Not thanks to the religious psychosis, which is a cancer, it's an HIV of the neural array making people stupid and ignorant. Religious people are theotardists stuck in the 12th century. They shouldn't be using the internet. If you believe in God, Christians, imbeciles, that go to all the churches, go to Grand Canyon, go to Grand Canyon, and jump, saying, in Jesus' name, we jump <laughs> and get a life after death. Put your, your faith and your, where your mouth is. You, if you believe in, in, in zombie Jesus and all that crap and all the mythologies of the Bible to be reality, what are you doing in this evil planet? Go to Grand Canyon and jump. Kill yourselves. Kill yourselves. And enjoy life after death uh, uh, with some bitches. But they are cowards. Islams are very true. They believe in their faith. They kill themselves <laughs> for Allah to get the virgins. <laughs> but Christians are cowards. They are idiots. They are hypocrites. They never, they never, anything that they believe, they are idiots. They are theotarded. They are ignorant, deluded, racist. Christ psychotic infected imbeciles of standing to us and benefiting from technology created by atheists, same people. So don't use the internet, morons. Write notes and send pigeons around if you want to communicate imbeciles. So that's what happens. So I enjoy the truth. Enjoy the truth. I love you all. We are all related, dear brothers and sisters. <laughs> Just keep in mind, it's all in our DNA. We're all related. And we were all black 200,000 years ago. Yes, coming from Africa, that's the fact. We didn't get blue eyes and white. No, those are mutations. It takes, it takes uh, uh, 15,000 years for the color of the chin to change, the color of the eye, all these mutations to take effect. But that's the truth, dear friends. Enjoy the truth. As, as always, I always... Tell facts. Patch it, the orange.